just flip it. Ta da! This is the right side, and this is your lining that will touch the skin. Since my daughter is really picky about the fabric that will touch her skin, she always complains that it's itchy. I have to make sure that all the dresses I made for her has a lining. So that's front side, and this is the back side of the fabric. So now what we're gonna do is, um, you have to sew this one right here, if you can see. Sew it from here to here after you do the neckline so that the lining will stay inside and it will not move around. So I have to do it on the other one. After sewing the neckline, you need to make sure that you cut, you cut the excess seam allowance. And then you cut from here to here just to make sure that your curve is clean when you turn it to the right side. Next is we're gonna sew the shoulders right side together just make sure that your seam on both sides matches so now we have to sew the armhole together we're gonna have to do this flip it just like that and then we'll have to do the burrito uh, technique. Now this is the tricky part, like sewing together uh, the armhole with a lining. Um, every time I do this, I always have to go back to YouTube and watch the tutorial because for some reason, I always mess this one up. This is what you're going to do. You do it like that and then you have to roll this together. This is what they call as the burrito technique. And then make sure that your seams both of your seams are on both sides are aligned and you just have to pin everything all of your armhole together and then you sew and then you do it on the other side and that's it you have to sew from here all the way down to here that we have sewn this we need to make sure to cut the seam and then because this is a curve now that you're done with that you just have to pull Sew together the other armhole. You take this side and the other side, and you put them right side together. Make sure that you pin these two together. Make sure that the seam and this are aligned, and then all you need to do is sew from here to here. together now time for the second to the last step which is putting everything together so here's what you're gonna do you're gonna have to sew the lining right sides together so you have to do this and pin them like that make sure that they are the like the seams are aligned. Let's pin that one. So from here all the way down to the end of the lining.
<laughs> now we have to make the belt and the bow. 